On December 9, 2018, Ria Shaw and his friend Karam Chan Kemraj were on a pedal cycle when they were struck down by a minibus driven by a Chinese national. The driver, after hitting the duo, sped away and is yet to be apprehended. Public spirited persons rushed the injured teens to the Georgetown Public Hospital where Kemraj succumbed while being treated. The teen was said to have received injuries to his spinal cord, sustained a broken hand and leg, along with a punctured lung. Shaw, on the other hand, sustained a broken shoulder and left hand with severe brain damage, which left him paralyzed after being hospitalized for over two months. In a turn of events, Shaw, who was expected to be affected for the rest of his life following the accident, was seen taking a midday ride when the evening news visited his home on Wednesday last. Well, when he asked about too much pain, too much. Mm -hmm. Yeah, too much pain, too much. And what about now? Are you doing everything that you used to and so on, or has your life changed? No, no, I can do everything. Like, one, two things, so I can do it. Tell me about what those are. Let me can do one thing. Well, I used to do. Well, one time I used to do like speak a kind of song. I used to do. Used to like do when I'm born. Speak like when I'm born. Miss me more back to myself. Well, I can do back to good now. Mm -hmm. But I like one, one thing I saw on the parts in my forehead and name. Mm -hmm. Just a name, yeah. And the hand, how's the hand working? Can you do all that you want to with it? or? Um, well, it can't come straight. They decide like come up to. Okay. Yeah. And you feeling? You see, when you tap it, you're going to get a bone. All this is a steel. steel. When questioned about Kemraj, Shaw revealed that he misses him a lot. Yeah, when I study him, I must study him. Yeah, I study him. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I study him. But you know, I can't take him because he don't like. Well, I miss him. I miss him bad. Because you know, like, any way you go, you scare me. Like, if any way you go. Shaw's father, Yakum Shaw, revealed his joy for his son making a full recovery and continues to hope for the best. Well, at least me feel happy that, you know, he recover back and he can do things for himself and things like that. I really, really, really feel good. I ask God every day for that. I don't want to go and walk on me. I don't want to do nothing. Just so he recover back, he can do for himself and there you are. Because at one thing, yeah, he's close, he can't do nothing for himself. We used to feed him from um, chop tree nose. Mm -hmm. When did we take it out, sometimes you sit on the chair, you fall back, so you fall. You can't um, balance your own self. The family is trusting in God that one day the driver of the minibus will be brought to justice. Reporting for the Evening News, Kizzy Coleman.